Hello everyone, this is the YouTube channel of Candler and in this video I'm going to remove the bottom panel of the Skik 15MD7Y laptop and install two SSDs. Those are the two SSDs which I will install and I will use a PH0 screwdriver to remove the screws. Close the laptop and flip to see the bottom cover. I put the laptop on a cloth to make sure that it will not be scratched. And those 10 screws will be removed. Remove the screws. Some of the screws are different in size, so I would recommend to separate the screws to place in the way they were in the laptop, so you can put them back in the exact position as they were there originally. Lift up the bottom cover starting on the front of the laptop. So this is how the laptops looks like inside. Those are the SSDs which I will install. The screws which will hold the SSD in its place is in the laptop, so I have to remove them. Install the SSDs, then secure them with the screws. This is a high resolution image of the laptop components. So those are the two SSDs. Those are the heat pipes for the cooling of the CPU and GPU which are leading to the two vents. This is the wireless LAN and Bluetooth module. This can be replaced. On the sides are the USB and audio jack panels. This is the battery which is 15.2 volts, 4000 mAh, which is 16.8 Watt hours. Those are the speakers. Those are the two DDR4 RAM modules. In my case, I have two 32 GB modules installed, so 64 GB total. Those are the connectors on the back of the laptop, which are the USB-C, HDMI, Ethernet and the power connector. Let's put back the bottom cover.
There is a tooth on the bottom panel of the laptop, so start with that side, and that tooth should be connected to the side of the laptop first. The bottom panel is in its place, so let's put back the screws. Check the sides of the laptop to make sure that the bottom panel is installed correctly, so there is no gap there. If you found this video useful, then please like and subscribe. Thank you for watching.